Ever wondered what happens when the meticulously planned space missions get delayed? In the infinite expanse of the cosmos, precision and timing are everything. Let's take a step back to revisit SpaceX's original plan, an ambitious mission to launch not one, not two, but four astronauts to the International Space Station, fondly known as the ISS. The astronauts were set to embark on their journey aboard the Falcon 9 rocket, cocooned inside a shiny new Crew Dragon capsule, endearingly named Freedom. This wasn't SpaceX's first rodeo, oh no. This would mark their fifth flight, ferrying astronauts as part of NASA's commercial crew program. The launch had been scheduled for the 27th of April, with a backup opportunity the very next day. The plan was to dock the ISS on the 24th of April, and the astronauts were geared up to spend a whopping 180 days in the vastness of space. But even the best laid plans can encounter unexpected hurdles as we're about to see. Just when everything seemed right on track, the unexpected happened. Welcome to the world of space exploration, where even the best laid plans can be derailed by unforeseen circumstances. This time around, it was the first ever all-commercial non-government crew to visit the International Space Station, better known as Axiom-1, that faced the brunt of unpredictability. Their journey, which was supposed to be a routine mission, was fraught with delays. The culprit? The ever-fickle weather. Yes, even in space the weather has its say. The uncertain weather in the splashdown zone off the Florida coast threw a wrench in the works, causing a delay that no one had anticipated. But that's not all. Complex trajectory requirements further complicated the situation, adding to the delay. Now let's delve a little deeper into the crew of Axiom-1. This pioneering team consisted of Michael Lopez Alegria, Larry Connor, Mark Pathy, and Aitan Stiba. These brave astronauts were originally scheduled to undock on a Tuesday, ready to return to Earth after their successful mission. However, due to the aforementioned weather conditions, their flight was extended. The crew had to remain in space, patiently waiting for a window of clear weather. Talk about a curveball. But as they say in the space business, flexibility is key. The crew adapted to the situation, targeting for an undocking on Saturday, with a splashdown off the coast of Florida on Sunday. Yet, as they hovered in space, the ripple effects of this delay were felt elsewhere. And, as if one delay wasn't enough, the domino effect was just getting started. The repercussions of this delay spread further, affecting other missions and shaking up the timelines of future space expeditions, but more on that in the next scene. The ripple effect of a single delay can be far-reaching, especially in space missions. In this intricate ballet of technology and timing, one misstep can cause a cascade of changes. That's exactly what happened when the Axiom-1 mission faced delays in returning to Earth. A seemingly simple delay due to uncertain weather in the splashdown zone off the Florida coast and complex trajectory requirements had a domino effect on other planned missions. This delay didn't just affect the Axiom-1 crew. It also had a significant impact on NASA's planned launch of four long-duration government astronauts aboard a different Crew Dragon spacecraft, known as Crew-4. The Crew-4 launch had to be rescheduled tentatively set for Tuesday, with additional opportunities available on April 27th and 28th. But the effects of the delay didn't stop there. In the world of space travel, every returning spacecraft needs to be thoroughly inspected and the re-entry data reviewed before the next mission can take off. Therefore, NASA needs a two-day gap between the Axiom-1 splashdown and the Crew-4 launch. This is absolutely crucial for ensuring the safety and success of the upcoming mission. So the delay in the Axiom-1 mission has not just affected the timeline, but it has also put a pause on the essential preparatory steps for the next mission. While the experts on the ground grapple with the changing timelines, the astronauts in space have to adjust their schedules and routines accordingly. And while the Crew-4 astronauts wait for their turn, the Crew-3 astronauts might have to extend their stay in space. This is a vivid illustration of how interconnected and precise every aspect of space exploration is, and how a single delay can ripple out to affect a multitude of elements in this grand cosmic dance. So where does that leave us now? The Axiom-1 crew, the first all-commercial non-government group to visit the International Space Station, is currently targeting an undocking for Saturday, with a splashdown off the coast of Florida set for Sunday. This change of plans comes after a series of delays caused by uncertain weather conditions in the splashdown zone and the complex trajectory requirements of the mission. But the implications of these delays don't stop there. 
they have a ripple effect, affecting other missions as well. This includes NASA's planned launch of four long-duration government astronauts aboard a different Crew Dragon spacecraft, known as Crew-4. Originally, the Crew-4 launch was tentatively set for Tuesday, but due to the delays with Axiom-1, it had to be rescheduled with additional opportunities available on April 27 and 28. NASA requires a two-day gap between the Axiom-1 splashdown and the Crew-4 launch to inspect the returning spacecraft and review re-entry data. This domino effect also impacts the Crew-3 astronauts, who the Crew-4 astronauts are set to replace. Their return to Earth may face a possible delay due to the knock-on effects of the Axiom-1 mission's delays. It's a complex dance in the sky, with each move intricately linked to the other, and the slightest delay can cause a significant ripple effect. What does this mean for the future of space exploration? Well, it's a stark reminder of the unpredictable nature of space travel and the challenges that come with it. Delays and setbacks are part of the journey and they serve as a testament to the immense complexities involved in sending humans to space and bringing them back safely. As we've seen, the world of space exploration is full of uncertainties and challenges. But it's through these trials that we continue to push the boundaries and explore the unknown.